It's the third match of the tournament. They've uh, won one and uh, lost one. They lost against Nancolo uh, in a central defensive role because the injury to Zingai. Match referee gets us underway. The Senegalese side's looking a little bit disorganized. A draw that was in their match against Zimbabwe on day two. First shot in anger comes from this break here for Zimbabwe and Shadrick Nyawa is always going to be a player to make his name felt and a good pass into the middle brings a penalty as Delic Marimba goes down and the referee with no hesitation. Match looks as if he's going to take the penalty. Keeper goes the wrong way, Zimbabwe in front. They needed it. They needed to start on the front foot. Zimbabwe, we did mention earlier on. Positive goal difference as well. A little flick across, and that's quite inventive from Alassane Kanti. Not able to find the back of the net, but I do like the ideas from the teenagers. Oh, and a mistake in defence. Asubabu Nigu is giving Nyama and Amini a bit of a hard time. There's a ball clear off the line. Doesn't matter, it's offside anyway. It was mighty, mighty close. This match as well from Senegal. They're not hanging about, and there's a bit of space for Abdu and Doya. Captain and left sided fullback. Space available for the header. Marvin and Colo misses the target. Well, they're living dangerously at the moment, Zimbabwe, and uh, I was on it. Space out wide, the keeper's on a struggle, and they can't tap it in on the near post. It's a good save. For the guests. Oh, the ball's been spilled, and at the second time of asking, it's Ndoya, who taps it over the line for the equaliser. Goalkeeping mistake from Apisa, who spills the ball for the second time in the half. He got away with it the first time, a corner for the second. Mendy. For me, poorly taken set piece. Another goal. And they're trying to get that now. Nice turn from Kante. Before in the second half, because this one is 1-1 one, one at half time. Looking uh, quite interesting. We'll go through that for you in a moment. Go and an opportunity in the middle of the park for Brian Panda. Kane over the top. Diallo. Good defending from Mkolo. Kolo. Back on the field of play, it's a good opportunity on the cutting side, but unfortunately wide of the target to be the side that applies the pressure. Look how well he got into position there, Abdu and Doya. It does always, always seem to be going well than everything in the side netting. I didn't understand what he was trying to do on the near post though, and I do understand that shot as well from Osaka. He does have a venomous boot behind the Sarupinda at the moment. It's a fantastic save from Martin. Might be tested again. Out, out is the call, out, out is the save from Martin, who makes two brilliant saves in the second half. Dien, on oh, another good save, although we would have hesitantly against Malawi. How much strength are they still going to have to carry the game into Malawi? They might not need a goal against Malawi because uh, that's Mohamed Bar who will score his first goal of the tournament. And Senegal have scored two in a row to come from behind to lead over Zimbabwe.